A dream come true tonight for dinosaur hunters and anyone who really loved Jurassic Park. Scientists in Prince George's County just announced the discovery of a massive bed of bones in what's now Laurel. Yeah, I mean, these are ginormous. A huge collection of fossils, including a thigh bone from a dinosaur wow. similar to T-Rex. Bruce Lachan <laughs> has been digging into it. On a day so sweltering, it felt almost Cretaceous. Scientists announced a discovery that has them sizzling with excitement. I have a, a sneaking suspicion that the flow is kind of going behind me. Here, where an ancient river once flowed. So if we want to find more bones, we're going to have to go this direction here and well up into this hill here. Researchers from the Maryland National Capital Parks have discovered what was likely once a giant log jam where the bones of scores of dinosaurs piled up about 115 million years ago. They call it a bone bed. This may have been accumulated over a season, but probably no longer than that. Entombed here in a layer of ironstone, the shin bone of a 38-foot carnivore, most likely an Acrocanthosaurus. A meat eater almost as big as Tyrannosaurus. Sharp toothed theropods, clawed, long-necked astrodons, a vertebra found just this week. And it's just literally been bone after bone after bone. This is the biggest find in this part of the country in almost 150 years, elevating the old dinosaur park to another level. This site is the best dinosaur site east of the Mississippi. This could be more than simply ancient history. The changes geologists are seeing during the Cretaceous era could help us predict and prepare for the changes of the Anthropocene, the age of human caused impacts on the Earth. Geologists and paleontologists have long been aware of the potential of abrupt climate change to disrupt the world around us. And for that reason, we were among the first to sort of sound the alarm. This is a little chunk of bone, probably a bone fragment from a rib. Dinosaur Park invites the public to dig. The light blue-gray color, that's the telltale sign. The first and third Saturday of every month. It's cool. In Laurel, Bruce Lachan, WUSA 9.